You want the beauty secrets, babe? Especially with women like you. Hey boo, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, my name is Kiki Carr and I am a licensed esthetician and makeup artist. So anything you hear on this channel is professional advice. So in today's video, we are doing a step-by-step -step makeup tutorial for beginners, specifically over 50 because I know for sure my over 50 girlies just don't like a lot, okay? They want it quick and they want it easy and guess what boo i feel you okay i am the same way myself i can go from zero to 100 baby okay zero days that i am walking around drenched in skincare nothing on i don't want to do no makeup at all i just want my skincare on because i'm oily skin acne prone and i'm typically in some type of healing state you know what i mean i'm always battling with my skin it's never just okay and just perfect and then i can go 100 okay full 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 glam all right let's layer after layer of palette on very glamorous but you know that type of look it isn't practical it isn't what we do every day it's a special occasions type of thing so that happy middle that happy medium is what we're doing today not super glamorous and also not zero. And my personal beauty secret for looking way more put together and looking like I put way more effort in than I did and looking more glamorous than I actually am is popping on a lash. This, like, you want the beauty secrets, babe? This is the beauty secrets I'm trying to tell you, okay? And we're talking about a beautiful mink hair lash. We're not talking about the waxy looking artificial lashes that cost a dollar from the hair supply store that people be wearing and popping straight on their eye, not customizing it at all. It looks fake. It wears funny. It's heavy. It looks waxy. Like, we're not talking about those. We're talking about a beautiful lightweight mink lash that mimics real hair that's very comfortable to wear and reusable okay um i'm going to be showing you the lashes that i use that i sell that i promote now i want to hear that you don't know how to put them on because i have a tutorial on my channel showing you how to put on lashes when you want to look like you've put in more effort than you actually have never neglect your brows and never ever ever neglect your lashes if you want to do mascara do mascara but never ever ever neglect your lashes because the lash is what really makes your eyes pop if you're not that good at eye makeup you need a lash okay if you want to look glamorous and beautiful and all done up but you don't know how to do eye makeup you need a lash if you want to look like you put in more effort than you did you need a lash sis you not too old for it okay because when people are looking dead at you all they see is a beautiful eye look that looks pop that looks glamorous you just look good when you're looking dead at people okay i know it's a lot of jokes out here about the big fluffy lashes but honestly a big fluffy lash done right and the quality of that lash it can really really make you look so glamorous like people tell me all the time like you look so pretty and all i have really done is just put a little concealer on filled in my brows and popped on a lash for a normal everyday basis you definitely want to go with the long comb concealers these are so lightweight and they cover like a dream i have everything here to be able to contour and highlight and correct any little blemishes these are like all of the shades that i need and when i tell you i love this concealer because you can just tap it in with your finger it melts right in and it looks so natural it wears so natural it's just like it's like it's like it's like a second skin so enough talking let's jump right in so as you can see i have my skincare on already i'm gonna start with putting my under eye concealer on first this is in shade 460 and I'm gonna let that just be sitting on my eye while 
I do my brows. And we're just filling these in very, very lightly. Okay, now that the brows are done, I'm going to go in with my flesh tone shade and just do color correcting across the face where I have like dark spots, old acne marks and stuff like that. I tell people all of the time who are beginners at makeup and they want to get better, you definitely need your tools, you definitely need the right brushes and stuff like that. If you ever want to get like good, 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 the products like these, oh, super beginner friendly. And what I love, love, love about this the most, it's kind of foolproof because it's going to melt in and it's going to look just like skin. If you want your makeup undetectable, you don't want people knowing that you've concealed, this is it. If you watch me before, you know I love this step. I'm gonna always take a shade of concealer that's a little bit too light for me and highlight with it. And then I'm gonna take one that's way too light for me and brighten with it. And we're gonna keep this really tight, just a little bit on the tip of the nose and then right in the inner corner of the eye. Okay, now we're just going to stamp this in. Okay, now we're gonna take shade 560 and I'm gonna contour my nose with it. And what I love about it, the wand, it really makes it so easy. If you wanna just take your flesh tone concealer and tap those little marks away like I showed you and pop your um, lash on, that would totally be good enough. Don't let everyday makeup make you think I don't mean complexion because I do. Okay, let's put on a little Fenty gloss. So this is the high maintenance lash. It's short, it's wispy, it's lightweight, it's delicate, it's dainty. It is so feminine and it's a bestseller. Okay, so the next lash is the Fierce Lash. I love this lash so much. It looks dense, it looks black, but it's not. It's so wispy and so beautiful and so light, and it fits perfectly underneath my glasses. So this is the blessed lash. This lash is class. This lash is sophistication. This is the lash that you want to wear when you are trying to impress. But not over the top impress, just subtly impress. You just want to turn heads and you want people to be like, who's that girl? Na 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 na. Okay, so next up is the Bad B Lash. I can't lie to you. These are my favorite lashes. I know they may look a little bit intimidating, but let me just assure you that when you customize them to your eye, which means cut a little bit off of the end so that it fits your eye perfectly, you place it, you just set it down right on the eye. You don't get too complicated with it and you're looking straight ahead at somebody, all they're gonna see is beautiful, glamour, wispy goodness. These are the lashes that I wear to go to the gym. These are the lashes for my no makeup makeup looks. These are the lashes that are so glamorous and beautiful, it makes you look like you have done a full beat. When in actuality, you just have on a little concealer and a bomb is lash, okay? Now, boo, don't go blinking around him with these lashes on now. No, no, because you are bound to be sitting up telling me, Kiki, I'm expecting. 
look i done warned you lashes are that girl i'm trying to tell you like diamonds are not a girl best friend lashes are they dress your eyes on their own if you have not already signed up for my free vip beauty community sis i would love for you to do so the link will be in the description box it's all about beauty makeup skincare fashion content just like this will be sent straight to your inbox i'm gonna be putting you up on game like i did today everything that i know i'm gonna share with you skincare ingredients that are going to do wonders for your skin affordable fashion makeup that is having a moment that is all the rave everybody's talking about it what i know and what i learn i'm gonna teach you so if that sounds like something you may be interested in go ahead and sign up if you enjoyed today's video like comment share and subscribe and i'll be sure to see you on the next one Mwah. i've been losing friends and finding peace honestly that sounds like